hello welcome back to another vlog as you can tell by the title it is another travel vlog we are currently on a cruise it is a seven day caribbean cruise we're going to st thomas st martin and dr on this cruise with celebrity cruise if you guys have been on my channel for a while then you would have seen last summer i think it was like july or june i went to alaska with celebrity cruise i worked with them as a talent basically i traveled with their in-house photographer to shoot content for their social media pages so i'm back in my room for about i want to say like 15 minutes before I have to leave because our first activity is a sell away cocktail mingle situation so I'm gonna quickly give you guys a room tour and then gonna get going so this is the door I have not unpacked anything so you will see my luggage this is the view of the room when you come through the door and then on the right here we have the bathroom we might as well get into it while we're here this is the bathroom we have a standing shower here it is pretty spacious honestly let me go in so you can see the shower is pretty spacious and then this is the toilet And then this is the sink area. And then right next to the bathroom, we have, you know, the light switch, the AC control system. And then there's these little areas. I don't know what you would use this for. We have some laundry bags. And then this is the closet right over here. There are two robes and pretty, a ton of hangers to choose from. And then you have your drawers. Oh, there's a full length mirror here. Didn't realize that. That's good. And then this is the bed. It's a pretty spacious bed. And then you have the sitting area. my luggage another little side table over here the couch a little chair the table area a mini bar real nice <laughs> All right, so I am back in my room. We just had a little happy hour, cocktail hour situation. We were on the rooftop of the ship and they had like a little private section for us. So we had a little a little snack and things. My hair looks a mess, but I have about, whoa. <laughs> the boat is moving. The boat is shaking. I have about one hour to basically get what I need to get done and then head over to dinner. In that one hour, I need to unpack all of my clothes because I just don't feel right until everything is unpacked. I am one of those people that need to unpack everything before I can feel comfortable. And then I need to like freshen up. I need to throw some curls in this hair, figure out what I'm gonna wear for dinner. I might need to steam what I'm wearing and then get ready for dinner. Okay, so clothes are in the closet. My toiletries are up, everything is up. As you can tell, I really unpack when I tell you guys. I like to unpack because I like to feel like I'm at home and I like to feel comfortable. It just makes my process a lot more seamless. So I'll be unpacking, okay? Always running late per usual, but this is the outfit. The skirt is from Farm Rio. The top is from Good American and the shoes are super old, but they are from Lulu's. And then my Poland bag. 
that's the outfit it is the next day it's monday i am all ready to head out for the first activity the first task of the day we are shooting a dinner for one of the restaurants on board because for the production we don't want any of the guests there we want to capture the food the chefs making the food and things like that and capture um us the talent i think it's me and someone else so we're staging a dinner this morning so i have to look like i'm going to a dinner <laughs> okay i don't have my shoes on yet but i'm wearing this this black and white top from zara and then these pink long wide leg pants that i've had for a very long time i got them from i want to say nasty gal i think they're from nasty gal but yeah this is the outfit the lighting the lighting in here is not the best but this is what i'm wearing this is what it will look like once i have heels on At this point, I was 16 days strong into my Daniel fast and shooting these scenes were super duper hard for someone who loves wine and I was not able to drink any of it. I was just putting the cup to my lips and not even sipping it at all. You had three glasses already today, so yeah. skipping. <laughs> skipping. You can't have a full bottle before too, I guess. Right? Ready? Play one more time. And action. So something I'm committed to doing this year is maintaining my morning routine even when I'm not at home. This allows me to get back into my daily groove when I return home. So I started today like I normally start, which is by praying, doing my devotional, and going for a quick workout. Going up.
the beauty of waking up early and just starting the day early is that most of the guests are still asleep so you get to walk around and enjoy the view without a whole bunch of people around so here is a mini tour of some of my favorite spots on board This part of the ship is called the magic carpet and I think it's super cool because it sits on the outside of the ship and they are able to move it from floor to floor. So this is where you would come if you want to catch a beautiful sunset. still trying to run on a schedule even on this cruise because I have a tendency to get off balance whenever I go out of town at around 10 o'clock I'm going to start getting ready because my first shoot is at noon and I'm trying to make it there at least by 11 30 so yeah I have a few like client and like personal work to do and then I'm gonna start getting ready another restaurant shoot and this is what I wore I took my shoes off I was getting ready to take my dress off and then I realized that I haven't shown you guys what I'm wearing so here it is it is this dress from Express I wore it when I worked with Express a few months ago this is my makeup I went for a little bit more glam today so I got some eyeshadow on and then I had on the same black heels that I had on yesterday but yeah this is what I had on so I drop it down to 24. It really helps. If I do the 60, it looks like strobe sometimes. Yeah. 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 Just one? Just one. Oh, pass it? <laughs> Three quarters down now. So that one is one ounce, and uh -huh. you see the line, the first line here? Uh huh. That one is three quarters. The first line. The first one. Okay, all the way at the bottom. No, all the way to the top. Oh, okay, so yes. one full and then. No, no. Uh, just, just. To oh, the just line. three quarters. Yes. Okay. Three quarters. Clearly. Three more. Yes. Right? My brain is like, we're not. You know that lady? Have you seen that video? Where she's like, three shots of vodka. Yes, and it's yes. like, the whole glass. Yes. That's me. Two shots of vodka. <laughs> A little bit more? Okay. Don't skip on the vermouth. Right? <laughs> Not that much. Really? Like, we're kind of professional. Like, no, kind of? Really, like, I was like, more worried about the people below. I'm like, there have to be the world. It's like, we're on floor three. Oh, yeah. I'm there's like, no, no, no. <laughs> and also, it was just funny because like, jumping on the we were no, like, you guys did it down. so good. Like, but the outfits Let are me see it again. You have to hear with the music. Yeah, do it with the sound. 
No, but I that was my life. I scared me. You didn't get in trouble for doing that. So I just like didn't. What I didn't then. I didn't put it on a um, public. Yet. Oh. Mm-hmm. I just showed you something. No, you guys are good. Especially when you guys are doing it together. <laughs> oh no, that was too good. <laughs> no, that was too good. No, that was you really good. Show you guys are so coordinated. <laughs> like over stirring. You need ice cream. Here you go, Ellie. All for you. <laughs> Give rate it ten, one to ten. Nine out of ten. It's quite tart, but I love the orange scent. Do we just pour? Oh, I have to. Okay. I have to measure. Half an ounce. What is that? The second line? The second line. Second line, okay. You ready? Okay. Like it's rolling up. <laughs> On the side. Yes. Look Excellent. at that. Oh. Alrighty, a little outfit change. This is what I'm wearing. This dress is from Petal and Pup. I've had it for about a year now and it is so cute the back is open it's so flirty and girly and it got pockets which is my absolute favorite thing in the whole wide world so we lit <laughs> Well, day four, if you count the day that we left, it's Wednesday, and I am up early. I ordered myself some room service because we have a pretty long day today, and I just need <laughs> to stay in my room, eat, and get myself together. It's currently 7 a.m., so it's 7 a.m. ship time, local time, but 6 a.m. back home. So that had us tripping up a little bit because whenever we get to a destination where the time is about to change the ship time starts to change you know to match the destination's time but my phone is on airplane mode so my time is not changing and it's not allowing me to manually change it as well that has been tripping me out so i have to keep adding an extra hour to make sure that i'm running on time we are arriving at our first destination which is phyllisburg st martin i'm excited i've never been to st martin before actually i've never been to any of the countries that we're going to on this trip which is st martin st thomas and dr i'm gonna keep my makeup super light today because our activities we're doing a private journey which typically is a tour of the island i don't know the full details i just know that we're doing a tour which includes lunch and i guess there's like some shopping involved like there's a market where you can shop and walk around and do things and then we're gonna go to a beach at the end of our tour and to my knowledge it's a the beach is not that spectacular but there's an airport really close to the beach so whenever the planes are about to land they go really low so if you're at the beach you can get a picture of the airplane on top of your head so that's one of the reasons why most people go there just to get that picture with the airplane so that's the 
itinerary for today. This is what I got for breakfast. I got some fruits. I got a bagel, a plain bagel with cream cheese. And then I got some tea, some mint tea. Didn't bring me any utensils. What am I supposed to do? I didn't get any utensils. <laughs> like, am I gonna get this cream cheese with my fingers? <sighs> the struggle. <laughs> Going on our own tour <laughs> before our tour starts. There's a truck coming right behind me. I didn't even see. Sorry. This no, but this whole time it's like peeping, and I'm thinking it's on the other side. Wow. Wow. That's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. <laughs> embarrassing. So where are we right now? We are in Saint Martin. Beautiful. Is that even Saint how you Martin. say it? Yeah, Saint yeah. Martin. Saint Martin. It is gorgeous. It is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. The sun is shining. So here are some historical facts that I didn't know before this trip. Saint Martin is located in the Caribbean Sea. Well, that I knew, <laughs> but it is divided into two different countries, the Dutch side and the French side. The Dutch side of the island is known as Saint Martin, and it is part of the Kingdom of the Netherlands, while the French side of the island is known as Saint Martin, which is part of the French Republic. The two sides still maintain their own culture, language, currency, and customs, which is pretty interesting considering you can get from one side to the other in a matter of 10 minutes. I want that sweet life, I want that fancy life, I don't want to live a fast life. Oh, you have a mission, oh, could you be going there, oh, say now your hand is there, oh, they make you bless my way, as I know we like so. back in our room showered and ready for dinner it is currently 7 50 we have dinner at 8 30 
So I'm all dressed. I'm not wearing any makeup because we're not shooting tonight. We're just having dinner and we're having dinner at Le Voyage, which is one of the Michelin star. I, I think it's a Michelin star restaurant on board. I know the chef that created the restaurant is a Michelin, is a Michelin star chef, but I don't know if the restaurant itself is a Michelin star. But it's called Le Voyage. We shot there the other day, but we didn't really get to eat the food. We were just, you know, doing the shoot. So we're gonna have dinner there. That should be fun. The food looks really good. I'm not wearing anything interesting. I just have on this black top from Express. It's part of their body contour collection. And then these pants, ooh, can't remember the brand. I will link it below but it's a company i worked with i want to say last year but i love these pants they fit really good and they're super duper comfortable so that's what i'm wearing i'm just doing an all black moment and then i'm gonna wear the same black heels i've been wearing this whole time so that's the outfit as you recalled i was doing the daniel fast which meant no alcohol but after the day that i had today i gave in to a glass of viv clico <laughs> From two bites. Very soft. I'll do the brioche as well. Thank you. Serve a bit of lentil or goo. I will do by the sauce and uh, cherry for the cherry sauce. It's here. Oh, great, great, yeah. Thank Alain. you, my friend. Yeah. Thank you so much. Alain with a romesco, crusted with a peanut sweet and sour egg well. And uh, risotto omar, it's a lobster risotto cooked with a sauce American. Garnished with a balafouche lobster, cherry tomatoes, and zucchini. Thank you. Merci. Merci. Merci beaucoup. Merci. Hello, hello. It is our second port day, which is St. Thomas. We are in Charlotte, Amali, St. Thomas. And our excursion today, I think half of the group is doing a catamaran tour which is like snorkeling and things like that and then the other half which is just me and someone else and the photographer we're doing something i don't remember exactly what it, <laughs> what we're doing but i know we're doing something different We arrived in St. Thomas where we took a ferry that took us to St. John Island. Both St. Thomas and St. John Island are part of the United States Virgin Islands. We wanted to go to St. John Island because we were told the beaches there are some of the best beaches in the world. And so we drove around the island and got to see some of the beaches. St. John Island is made of two parts. There is the national park, which is on the no north side. And then there is a private island, which is on the south side. The national park is a popular tourist destination and it is known for their pristine beaches and less tropical forests. It is 
another beautiful day on board another day living the dream <laughs> so we are getting ready to arrive at the port which is in Puerto Plata Dominican Republic um, we're doing a water activity today so that should be interesting because I can't swim we're going to a waterfall and then we have to jump but you don't have to because they have slides and stuff but it's a natural waterfall uh, so that should be exciting. I'm always down for new adventures or doing something that I've never done before, um, which that's one thing I've never done before. But I'm always like, no matter how fearful I am of something, I'm always willing to try it because I don't let my fears get in the way of me living life. So yeah, but I'm up early because we have a shoot this morning, as always. That's all we've been doing here. Um, we have a shoot at the retreat. Most celebrity edge class ships have a retreat, if not all of the ships, I don't know. But this ship, the Beyond ship, has a retreat section and that's basically for guests who are staying in the retreat class rooms. And it's basically an area that is exclusive to retreat guests. They have their own bar, they have their own dining hall, like they have their own dining area. It's super beautiful. So we're gonna go there and capture some content, which should be great. And I am wearing a bathing suit for the very first time on this trip. It's actually really, really cute. If you watch my Mexico vlog, I talked about how Somersault sent me a whole bunch of bathing suits that I have not worn, and this is one of them. I wore one in that vlog but this is another one that this is my first time wearing and it's super duper cute if you're a little body conscious like myself and prefer to wear one piece suits that really snatches you up this is the brand for you and they're super cute as well Like, not too bad, not too shabby. Get this bitch. Why not? I mean, people pay for work up classes all the time. I know. <laughs> <laughs> song triggering you? Thank 
the Evo 5 to get some birds. Maria, how's your Uber ride going? My Uber? Very great. Five stars? Five stars. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, look you walk back this way. Looking, like kind of looking up, you know, like yeah, slow, take your time. Honestly and truly, did you go on a cruise if you didn't go to the casino? Well, I've been on a few cu cruises and this was my first time at the casino. I decided to take my $20 and all of my dreams and test my luck. I was determined to go home a millionaire because I had a winning spirit, you know? But all I left with was negative $20 in a dream. $0. I only have $2. Shit. I don't even have enough to play. Serious? Oh, well, I you do. Does that. Did you win? I won 50, so I added to what I had. 50 cents? <laughs> On the last full day on board, I started the day by taking some time to myself to really reflect on this trip overall and honestly just sit in gratitude. Ready. Can she, let's have her open it. No way, right? Ready and action. And then now to grab it, like you're gonna take a sip. Oh, go, 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 go. So, we drank a little bit too much already. <laughs> okay, wait, let me show you pouring the... Wherever you... Can you, you, you tell me about the mic? Yeah, this, this will be fine here. Okay. This is what you get to do for a living? So long. <laughs> And 
action. No, we're all we're set. All set. We're just Thank eating you at this. So much. <laughs> Thank you. It was we're just amazing. enjoying it. Thank you. <laughs> Poppy, stay cool. This is so much better than Poppy steak. I've never been to Poppy steak. Really? I want to know about it. It's okay. Shot Tuscan had them make a bunch of um, this morning. Meals. Yeah. Great. Right. So okay. Good. Good. We shot with the, with John and Anastasia. So here's the deal with this. So it's a wine pairing with cheese. Okay. So we need to get some like setup shots. I got a, a few okay. on the phone, but I think it'd be good to have. Of course. Um, Even more than hundred different top kinds of wines, just to make one cuvee, right? The cuvee is what you have here. Brother, use a lot of muscadel. But what we're having here is an icon, Chateau Carbonu. You may know, you may not know, but after the tasting, if you Google it, you will realize that it's very famous. Chateau Carbonu is not famous because of the marketing, no. Chateau Carbonu is famous because of the history. The history is already created by Chateau Carbonu. Chateau Carbonu is coming from the southern part of Bordeaux. Bordo. We have in the northern part, we have, for example, uh, this just well, transported me to Spain. Okay. And the southern part of Bordeaux also is having some like very good, very good, and expensive uh, Bordeaux and chateaus. Mm. And this is coming from the Presac Grignan. Sorry for my pronunciation in French, disaster. Presac Grignan, right? We cannot, we cannot speak about Bordeaux in terms just focus. And start to, I have white, white flowers, for example. <laughs> We serve the whole lobster, as you can see, even the claws. It's come with sweet corn sauce, whiskey bacon, roasted potato underneath, finished with chili pizza oil on top. <laughs> and then the lemon tart. Guys, it is our final briefing in this bathroom. We are going home today. It is the final day on this cruise. Not even a day because we're checking out this morning, but it's Sunday and it's time to go. This has been such an amazing experience. Every time I take a trip with celebrity i come back so refreshed like even though this was work and not pure leisure i still had fun i still relax enjoy myself i am super duper grateful for opportunities like this because wow like such an amazing experience if you made it this far in this video thank you guys so much 
for watching. I hope this vlog was, you know, enjoyable to watch for you. I'll see you guys in my next video.